most of them really just want one thing you know, like for real, for real. you know what i'm saying most of them and just i know that <laughs> i know that nah like i know you know now nah, but this is just me sharing this with you you know what i'm saying like most guys bro they really just want to get you know what i'm saying your pants you feel me you it's your boy Auntie Ghoul and we're back with another banger. Peep this YouTube, you know what I'm saying? As you boys can see by the title, today I'm gonna be doing a mukbang, you know what I'm saying? Is it mukbang or mukbang gang? Mukbang. Isn't it a mukbang? Twin, it's a mukbang twin. That's a mukbang. That's a you, nah. Man, I don't even know twin, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, today we're doing the mukbang, you feel me? And yeah, listen, introduce yourself, you know what I'm saying? Hello guys, you know me. <laughs> I'm Cassie. You're good with the pranks, then you can introduce yourself. When you're pranking me, you can introduce yourself. Now, she's shy and shit all of a sudden, you oh, know what I'm saying? <laughs> but yeah guys, as you boys can see by the title, you know what I'm saying? Today we're going to be doing a little mukbang. I thought, you know what I'm saying, this is technically, I think the last video. That we shooting because she started school on like Monday. No, Wednesday. Wednesday, you know what I'm saying? She she a big girl now. She in matric, you feel me? So, <laughs> yeah, guys. And I'm also going back to varsity for real. So we thought, let me just let's just bond for real, man. The last video. Before. Yeah, like until whenever, because I don't even know when I'm gonna see grind. you again for real. So we have to grind. You know what I'm saying? Is, like I only see my brother like. Once, how how like, often we see each other in a year, guys? Once, maybe like four or three months. Yeah, not for real, but we don't be seeing each other a lot, guys. Cause yeah. I basically I don't live with her, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, especially when I go to varsity, like I stay close to, you know what I'm saying, varsity for real. So I don't be coming home like that, you know what I'm saying? So we thought let's just bond, you know what I'm saying, on the last video type shit. You feel me? So yeah, basically, as you guys can see by the title, I'm gonna be. Giving the relationship advice, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> From the expert. Listen, I'm the if expert. If I need it, I don't need it. You need it, man. You know what I'm saying? You need it. You feel me? Because I feel like, honestly, you know, you step in. You're about to be matric, gang. That's a big thing for real. You know what I'm saying? Like, matric is a big thing. But yeah, guys, so let's show you guys the food. I'm hungry, gang. I don't even, I don't even know about you for real. but So this is what we have. You know what I'm saying? We have wings. I don't know the flavors, you know what I'm saying? Like, for real, for real. I think it's... Sweet chili. Mm -hmm. What's this? I don't know, gang. Barbecue. barbecue. I don't eat barbecue. What you mean you don't eat barbecue? I don't like the like taste. But I'll try it. This girl is bougie, or like. No. That One thing about my sister, bro, she's bougie as hell, bro. Put a bust down on my wrist on God. That's my bitch on God. You ride better, ride with that stick on God. Better ride with that stick that rod. Stand out, sit in there, take it like quick on God. YouTube, YouTube, so peep this gang, I ain't gonna lie, I'm gonna keep it real with you boys bruh, these wings were passing, you know what I'm saying, so if you do see a little stain or two, you know what I'm saying, the boy was just having fun in the moment, and listen, I was fucking the wings up, my nigga, let me live, you feel me, I'm just putting a disclaimer out there for you boys, you know what I'm saying, but yeah, enjoy the video. Um, you're about to be 18, you know what I'm saying, that's like... A big stepping stone of your life for real you know what i'm saying i just thought as a big brother i should just give you advice for real you know what i'm saying especially on boys because i feel like you know what i'm saying like as a young woman you know what i'm saying like you're gonna need it for real you know what i'm saying type shit. i don't even speak to boys <laughs> i don't speak to anyone no you might not speak to anyone now but you never know who you meet like in the future type shit, you know what i'm saying mm. Mm. Yeah. I, first year or you see, I'm year. saying like we never know we're gonna come. But across, the thing bro. is, I know guys after it. Like I know, like you think you know, gang. No, I know. You think you know. <laughs> I know. But that's why I'm young. But yeah. So that's basically what the video is about. YouTube, you know what I'm saying? Let me just put my phone on silent because I see there is messages coming through and all types of shit. But yeah, first question though, like, how are you doing mentally, bro? Like, how is your mental, your mental health? Mentally, I feel like during this year, like, especially the beginning of this year, I just feel very, like, isolated in a way, which is a good thing, because then I can find... What do you mean isolated, home. though? Like, I do have friends, but it's like, I haven't seen them in a while, so the point where it's like, 
No, our school didn't even start yet though. On some shit, you know what I'm saying? No, man, not school friends. School friends and like friends outside of school. So you say you, you say you feel isolated, guy? Like. What? Yeah, but I know it's for good reason. Oh, I know. Like, cause I don't like people. I'm sorry. You're not really a social person like that. No, like I'm social in terms in public. Like I'll speak to people. Mhm. Mm but I'm very like to myself also. Mm. So I I guess it just depends on the vibe. But I don't like people in general. I don't like social media. Oh. Are you good though mentally though? That's the question. Yeah, mentally I'm good. Like I'm getting to know myself. Growing as a person, like, you know, mentally. Mm -hmm. I do have my days where I feel like, oh my word, like my life just feels stuck. Oh, I feel like. I don't find the song to play. Mhm. Oh, I feel like, you know, down. Wake up down. Yeah. But I don't like. My mental health is good. Like I'm a happy person. I don't walk around miserable. Like oh, I'm depressed. Like, yeah, that's good bro. You know what I'm saying? I'm glad your mental is okay. My mental is okay. Like, I'm not gonna lie. Right now, I'm just posting vids for real. You know what I'm saying? Second second thing I want to talk to you about is boys. You know what I'm saying? That's actually the main... That's actually what the whole video is about. Just boys for real. You know what I'm saying? Boys but, so guys. <laughs> boys, bro. Because... Yeah, boys. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So... I'm gonna keep real with you, you know what I'm saying, as your older brother. Bro, like, and this is me being blatantly honest with you and not sugarcoating anything. Guys, especially guys your age, bro. Like 18, 19. You know what I'm saying, like, most of them really just want one thing. You know what I'm saying, most of them and just. I know that. <laughs> I know that. Nah, like, I know you know now, nah, but this is just me sharing this with you, you know what I'm saying, like. Most guys, bro, they really just want to get, you know what I'm saying, your pants, you feel me? Most guys really just want to get their peepee wet, you know? Like, this is just me being real with you, you know what I'm saying, as your older brother. Like, literally, most guys, bro, they just want to really get in your pants, bro. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And I know you're a strong woman, you know what I'm saying? I know you're, you're very much independent. I have boundaries and standards. You know what I'm saying? No, that's good. But I know, like... You're very independent, you know what I'm saying? You're a strong woman. Like, I don't go around thinking, oh, like, I need to speak to a guy to feel happy. For sure, for sure, for no, sure. I can be happy on my own. Nah, I hear that, bro. And like I'm saying, I know you, like, you're independent woman, you know what I'm saying? And I just want to say, bro, that guys, guys really can't offer you anything. You know what oh, I'm saying? Yeah. Like, let's be honest, bro. What can a guy offer you? I mean, you're beautiful, and I want you to know that because you're my sister, you know what I'm saying? Like, you're beautiful. But 99% of these guys, bro, they can't really offer you anything, you know what I'm saying? And I want you to know, bro, like, as an older brother, it's like, I don't want you to ever think you, you have to go to a guy for anything, especially, like, materialistic things. That's why I'm here. That's why, I, like, I'm so hard on you, gang. Because it's like, I want you to know that like I'm here for a reason, you know what I'm saying? Before you, you call a guy for anything, I want you to know that you can call your brother. You know what I'm saying? Type yeah. shit. So if let's say I'm dating a guy next day as a car, <laughs> who am I gonna phone? You or him? I'll phone him. I no, I get mean. that, but what I'm trying to say is bro, like most guys, the only thing they can offer is materialistic things. Like, and this is me. And most of them are temporary. Like, it's only. Hey, I know, but hear me out. Let me speak. You know what I'm saying? Most of them can really only offer you materialistic things, bro. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And that's why I'm, I'm saying to you, bro, as an older brother, it's like, I always want you to know that you can always call me first. You know what I'm saying? If you need anything, bro. Because there's nothing, like, and this is me being real with you, gang. Like, there's nothing a guy can do for you materialistically that I can't do. Mm. Bro, why the fuck do you think I'm doing what I do? You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm grinding so hard. You see what I'm saying? It's for you, gang. You know, I want you I to... I want my Steve Maiden here for my, my MD. Gang, I got you. Guys, you still promised me now. <laughs> I want Steve Maiden for my heels for MD. My MD is in August. <laughs> yeah, I got you. You know what I'm saying? I didn't promise that. You feel me? But what I'm trying to say to you, Twin, is that, like, you, 
before you ever like and this is like in the next five years you can come back to this video if you need anything bro don't ever think you need to call another guy you know what i'm saying like mm -hmm. especially if it's especially if it's materialistic bro just rather call me you know what i'm saying like i got you you feel me like don't ever think you need a guy for anything because you got me and that's why i'm you in your life you know what i'm saying i want you to know that gang like for real for real because most guys and this is me being real with you bro like most guys they don't know what they want <laughs> besides that bro they don't really like they can't really offer you anything and you will see bro like as you go through this life bro, you feel me but yeah um like for real bro and that's the thing also now sorry like mom just keep mom just keeps texting me and shit you know what i'm saying like he's just asking where we are but yeah, another thing, let me just reply to her. Tell her we're eating. Yeah, I'll tell her. And yeah, another thing is, bro, it's like, you know you can be anything you want. Like, for real, for real. Like, as a woman, and society nowadays, bro, like, when it comes to women, you know what I'm saying? Like, they always say, now nah, a man has to do everything. But you know that you can become anything you want. Like, anything you want in this life thing, bro. You can literally achieve it. Yeah. So, dream big, bro. Like, forever. Like, I'm being dead as cash. You can become anything you want in this life thing. Don't let no one tell you, you know what I'm saying? You can't... Can't make it, though. You can't achieve anything. No, as a woman, you know yeah. what I'm saying? I'm letting you know. Because, like I'm saying to you, it's like... A lot of the time, there's this thing where now nah, only guys can do things, you know what I'm saying? You need a man, but you can really achieve anything you want to achieve for real. See what I'm saying? Like, right, these things are goal, hard. My goal is, like, when I reach the age of, like, 35, I'm going to stop working. <laughs> and you can achieve that. I'm going to come a housewife. I'm not going to work. But that's the thing, though. What I'm trying to... My what dream I'm, is to be a housewife. I hear you. I respect that. But like in my 20s, I do want to be... Like, I respect that, now. Nah. I want to make my own money. Exactly. Own what I'm trying to tell you is that, bruh, you need to realize that it's okay to... And that's why I always tell you, like, if you ever go out on a date with a guy, don't go on the date expecting him to pay. Mm. Like, go on the date with your own money. Like, yeah. carry... And this, listen to what I'm saying, like, when you go out on a date with a guy, carry your own money. If you can't pay for the... If you don't have enough money to cover the boat for the both of you, then stay at home. Like, don't go out on the date. I'm blocking if you can't block. No, bro, it's not even about that, bro. What, listen to what I'm saying. It's like, when you go out on a date, bro, always make sure that you have enough money to cover the whole boat. Just in case, you know what I'm saying? Like, you can't pay for it, bro. Because at the end of the day, bro, you want to be in... Like an independent hand, you understand? Yeah. You never want to rely. Because let me tell you about guys, bro. The minute you have that mindset of now, nah, like, like he must do everything, he must pay the bills. Fair that he'll pay the bills, but he'll control you. There's a lot that comes with that mm. shit. Like when a guy, like if he got out and he's like he can't go out. Besides that, bro. Like when a guy, when you give a guy that fair, that, like when you give a guy that power, where it's like. He's paying all the bills and stuff. Like, he will control you, bro. And this is me being real with you. Like, you know what I'm saying? As an older brother, like... So, you always want to make sure... That's why I encourage you to be independent. You know what I'm saying? Because mm -hmm. that way, a guy will never control you. You see what I'm saying? Like, for real, for real, bro. But I want to ask you, though. Like, what is your type in guys? Like, appearance or personality? <laughs> like, both. I think someone that's... Like, in terms of... um personality mm -hmm. someone that's funny because i like to laugh always laughing and someone that's um respect like respectful towards me all right, all right. and someone that also has like mm. boundaries as a as a guy you should have boundaries as well and someone that's like that knows what he wants if you're messaging me i mean why are you texting five other people like why are you entertaining mm. other girls you should be only about me so mm. a guy that knows what he wants i think mm. because if i know what i want i think okay i'm gonna get into a relationship this guy needs to know and i say to him let me tell you what you should look for in a guy so <laughs> okay 
the first thing you should make sure like when you're in a relationship with someone and also you, used to you should be, make sure you be, you should be able to trust that person just just hear me out have, before you speak like, just hear me out okay. you must be able to trust the person you know what i'm saying be comfortable around the person mm. you know what i'm saying like because that's a big factor like a guy should always make you feel comfortable if the minute a guy makes you feel uncomfortable you know what i'm saying it's damn near you but should how be does he make you feel uncomfortable? i'll get into that so just hear me out you should be able to trust the guy you should make you feel you know how like i make you feel like you're comfortable with me right now like i'm just saying like in the car oh, right like now safe like a conversation yeah. like safe you know what i'm saying yeah. That's how, if it makes you feel like that, gang, like, you know what I'm saying? So, another thing is, the minute a guy is inconsistent in anything, like, for example, he's inconsistent in texting you, he's inconsistent. I'll block you. <laughs> know your worth, bro. Like, don't be. I blocked him. Because blocked him. inconsistency leaves room for disrespect. Mm. So, don't ever, like, when you see a guy is inconsistent, like, nah, he's promising things. He comes back, he takes you at his own time. That leaves room for disrespect because he doesn't respect you. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, I know that. Imagine so, inconsistency, I'll block you, eh? I will block you. I don't have time. For sure. But always, always just keep that in mind, bro. I'm also inconsistent because I don't spend most of my time on my phone. Like, so, <laughs> I probably the inconsistent fine, but I don't really want that. <laughs> But like you know what I'm saying though Cause Yeah I hear what you're saying When's a guy Like a guy Like you know It's disrespectful For real for real Yeah and because it, if I text you Good morning And then you don't reply Like hello <laughs> Who are you speaking to <laughs> So I feel like yeah Inconsistency to Is a big And another thing is Also now of- Don't be delusional Like that's whatever you do Don't be delusional Please mm-hmm. bro I realized that, especially this year. Bro, like, I'm missing myself all types of It's not of worth it. Like, being delusional as a, uh, um, it won't get you anywhere. Like, you know he doesn't like you. He doesn't text you, he doesn't call you. Besides that, no. Put in effort, he doesn't like you. Like, oh, his wings are passing. Oh, what's the wings he out of 10? He doesn't call you. Like, out of 10. What did you I'll for? give it, like, I don't like barbecue, so Oosh. I'll give it, like, a 6 out of 10. Man, you tripping there. You I don't like the taste. Like, I would rather prefer, like, like, um, chili or... What I'm trying to say is, like, when you say don't be delusional, don't ignore red flags. Like, when you start speaking to a guy now, and you notice red flags... I'll run. <laughs> I'll please, run. like, 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 leave as talking. soon as you, po- as soon as possible, because a lot of women nowadays, it's like... They ignore it. And exactly. And then they get hurt, and then you feel It's like, hard, you start speaking hard. to a guy... You see all these red flags and then you ignore it. You know what I'm saying? You pretend like they're not there. And me telling you as an older brother, bro, is like... When when you meet someone, bro, when you start speaking to someone and there's red flags at the beginning, leave. Mm. Don't be delusional because... I don't know what's up with Hans. No offense, bro, but it's like... A lot of Hans are just... To Lulu. Like, oh! to Lulu for real. That's the term, It's twin. not going to get you anyway. Like, like they, for, they the Lulu for real, for real. And they wonder why they're flying over ticks. Mm. <laughs> Those hands and dads, me. I'm so sorry. I can't mm. be around you. Like, it's not like, real. Don't even start by acting the Lulu and then you blame the, the genes when you knew the red flags were there. And, you didn't, and you didn't do anything about it. So, don't even blame him. That's just who he is. Pray for him and move on. Because he will replace you. I wanna. Oh, bro, this, this wings is passing. YouTube, I'm literally like. You know what I'm saying I'm messing over myself, but I'm I'm enjoying this shit for real. But I want to tell you, ask you, I want to tell you, do you, would you say that you put like a lot of pressure on yourself, like as a person, like as a hand? I feel like with social media, mm-hmm. there are a lot of pressures in terms of looking a certain way or like mm-hmm. carrying yourself a certain way, not posting too much, posting too much, and I feel like. Me personally, this year I'm not going to be on social media, I'm deactivating it because I feel like it has a lot of like negative things, especially like in social media, like girls start feeling insecure and then if you like a gen's, One thing I'll tell you, a like, gen's as your post brother. and then he's liking other girls posts, I just feel like if you want to just remove yourself from it, just remove yourself from it, work on yourself, 
and come back a stronger person because like really gents will play you because they okay, don't know what you want aside. and they're just immature and they're just, I'll and tell they're you I'll boys. keep it with you right they're still boys wait right, listen listen to what I'm saying like, listen to what I'm saying like Never put pressure on yourself to be perfect. Mm. You know what I'm saying? And this is also not a point, bro, because that's why I asked you this question, because I want to know genuine chats. Like, are you, like, because there's a lot of pressure out there in the world, you know what I'm saying? And I'm glad you mentioned it how you're not going to be on social media and stuff, but like, genuinely, bro, like, never feel like you should, like, try and be perfect, especially mm. for. A man, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, no. <laughs> like one thing about me, I don't care about guys' opinions. I care about my and guys, opinions. bro. Like, I'm gonna keep it real with you, bro. You're beautiful. Like, this is why. You and seem... I, the thing is, I know that, but I'm very like, humble about it. Like, I don't. No, nah, hear me out, man. Like, You're beautiful. Oh. And a lot of guys, bro. A lot of guys are gonna when they see you, they're gonna be like, Nah, she's probably easy. I'm gonna use her. Like, I'm gonna probably stupid. like not even that, but it's like. I'll give them material things, you know, materialistic things, and then, you know what I'm saying? Make I promises. have a, Exactly. But I want you to tell you, bro, it's like, dude, that's why I'm here. And I'm going to keep it real with you, bro. The minute you feel me, like, you ever think, I need to hit up a guy for this, knowing that I can do it for you, I failed as an older brother. Yeah. Like, take me shopping or something. I know you have a car, you can do that. But... No, but like, before you ever even have to ask someone, bro, like, yo, I need this, this, call me, bro, mm. like, and this is literally, this is me being genuine, look at me, nigga, like, bro, like, <laughs> I'm, looking. I'm grinding, you feel me, like, yeah. I'm doing this, I'm not doing this for no one, but, well, fine, you, yeah. for no one, but, like, my, the people I care about, you know mm. what I'm saying, bro, so, when it comes to materialistic things, I'm here, bro, whether it's airtime, your nails, I know, and that's why I'm telling you, that's why I'm even doing this type of video, because I know I'm not going to be with you, but in the instance where, yo, you need money for something, or there's an emergency, you know what I'm saying, like, I'm all the way far, but, like, I can I can make a plan for you, before a guy, you know what I'm saying, because the minute you get to put putting a guy before me, it's when I fail, you know what I'm saying, like, as an older brother, so I'm just keeping it real with you, on some shit, you no, feel I get that, yeah. so just always remember that, though. And it's nice, those people who don't have older brothers. <laughs> no, like, no, it's, that's like, a thing. You know, let me tell you what it is now. It's like, some people have older brothers. But they're so, not close with him. And besides close, they him. won't, like, direct him in the right direction. I'm, I'm just here. Yeah. A lot of people will say, nah, you're overprotective, antsy, you know what I'm saying, chill. But in reality, bro, I just want you to, to really just know, like, besides beauty, beauty mm. fades, whatever. But, like, yeah. dude, you really, like, you know what I'm saying? You're really a strong, independent woman. And I want you to go in that direction in life. You know what I'm saying? Like, when it comes to, like I mentioned in dates, you always make sure you're one step ahead of the guy. You have your own money. You don't go there expecting him to pay the bill. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like, you're not, bro, come on. Like, the world's messed up, bro. There's hard, and I'm not even judging nobody. And it's nobody. all because of social media. I feel like if social media wasn't a thing, like, in this generation, we'll all be fine, guys. We wouldn't be depressed. We wouldn't have social anxiety without that. I was like, I feel like it's just about social media as a whole. Because that's where most people spend their time on. So if TikTok is feeding you this thing about guys and how. Lastly, bro. Don't play you. The last thing I want to say you. is. <laughs> if I ever catch you doing this, bro. Like, I really. For real. I'm a person with my, my twins. Doing what? But never feel like you have to over sexualize yourself for guys validation mm. and that's me saying don't ever feel like you have to post bikini pictures or not even bikini pictures oh, just no. over sexual over sexualizing yourself for a guy's opinion bro like validation you know what i'm saying like don't ever think you need to do that bro because i'm gonna kill you personally you feel me I just want you to know that, bro. But yeah, enough First about. First of all, most of those guys that like like the hands with bikini pictures or whatever, they wouldn't cuff them. Like think about it, because if especially in terms of like marriage and stuff, he wouldn't marry you. Just putting it out there. Mm. Like if you post your body on social media and you constantly seeking validation from other men, your man is not gonna put a ring on it because hello. 
Cover yourself up. It's a standard. I'm glad, I'm glad you know that, bro. No, I know that because you all think, okay, he's buying me flowers, he's spending money on me. Hello? Sure. But he's like, paying you. To lighten the conversation, because I feel like I've been talking about you, mm-hmm. would you say I'm a hoe? <laughs> I, feel like I was wanted to know. Because, like, no, like, be honest, be honest. Would you say, like, this is me right now? Would you say I'm a hoe? Where would you say, what do you, what do you think of me, actually, when it comes to dating? I don't even know eh? like it's hard to it's, it's hard to explain like hard to tell like i wouldn't say he's a whole like before yeah you know ah, but he was, in a long, he was in a long-term relationship he was very loyal right, right, w, w, so w, i w. feel like no he's not a whole but as of in right now i don't know who he's speaking to so i can't say how many hands he's speaking to no 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 i'm not speaking whole. to anyone you know what yeah, i'm saying so. i'm a little phase you feel me so yeah, but I feel like if you have your goals in place and you know what you want tonight, then there's no time for hoes because most of the time. For sure, that's what I'm on right now. They're just temporary and they're just gonna use you. For that's sure. my brother. Like he has a car, he has money. Hello, they're gonna use you. Nah, more, bro. And bro. they're gonna cheat on you. Bro. I'm looking for relationships. To be honest, like I'm just trying to get my bag up. Like I, I, I'm telling you, bro, I'm doing this shit to take. I first want to take care of my family. Like what you were saying about this, like the Steve Madden and shit. Like I got you. I actually want to go crazy for your birthday this year. Yeah, my 18th. My 18th birthday, you know. So I actually want to go crazy on some shit. So that's why I'm pushing. You feel me? But yeah, other than that though, that's really just what I wanted to say. And also, when you ever feel like you feel down, just watch this video. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm. play it when I'm not around. When I'm back in Oakland, you know, wherever the fuck I am. Or it's just play this video for real, you know what I'm saying? So you can see or remind yourself of who you are. Because this is, and, and me telling you who you are is out of love for real, you know what I'm saying? And I feel like even being able to speak to a camera and being on YouTube, I feel like it's made my confidence just go up, like, on a whole different level. Because now people can truly see me who I am. Mm, if you know me, you know me. If you don't, you don't. But, but I yeah, just, never. Yeah, Always just remember what I like when you have, always have to you doubt yourself a little bit. Just come back to this video because the reason why I'm even doing this video is so that you know two years down the line you can always come back to something where it's like you know you have someone you know what I'm saying that's there for you for real. But you two, you know what I'm saying. I don't want to make this too long. I see it's damn near 27 minutes. You feel me? But yeah, that was basically you know what I'm saying. Like I don't know if my advice was good or not. I feel like it was good. Decent. I feel like it was, but most of Oh, things, damn, people. Um, just wipe your sister. You know what I'm saying? Bossy. Listen, like I, Jesus listen, Christ I don't. It did help me to make me realize, okay. But at the same time, I knew it. <laughs> I just knew. Bro, but, but why? Okay, but like, the most important thing is, though, like, everything I said, bro, like, remember your worth, bro. And. Mm independent be an independent woman bro like come on you don't need an don't let society fuck up your head now nah, you need a man to pay your bills you can pay that shit yourself don't let society get your head to it that's all i want to say to you you know what i'm saying and so boys only, only want to get in your pants boys my, boys my o- listen you that's gonna pay all my balls. boys only yes. want to get in your pants bro boys only want to get in your pants remember this shit bro i don't know that but I'm gonna remind you though. I'm gonna remind you. I'm gonna remind you. They only wanna get in your pants, you know what I'm saying? So that's about 30 minutes, you know what I'm saying? So That's not 30 minutes, wasn't it like 20 minutes? 30 minutes, guys. Camera says 30 minutes. Oh. I was yapping the whole time, but I'm 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 I hope it helps you, you feel me? But yeah, YouTube. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna need you boys to like the video. Let's try and get this video to 500 likes in the first hour, you know what I'm saying? And if you, you know what I'm saying, you're a little girl out there and you don't have a big brother, you know what I'm saying? It's okay, don't worry, life's not But de- take this advice, take, take this advice, advice, you feel and me? just focus on yourself, delete social media. <laughs> yeah. You know you don't like social media, huh? I don't, and don't like, don't guys, the influence of your friends. They always ask me, they're like, what's your social, social media? If your friend has a boyfriend, don't think you need to have a boyfriend because they're not worth it. Yeah, for sure, so, for sure. just focus on yourself and... Yeah. Work towards your goals. But yeah, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> My food is finished, so the mukbang damn near over with because I don't got food. Yet. I-